Ah, <laughs> uh, I gotta take it off for the for the headphones here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everyone out there. Antagonizer two thousand here with you, and we are back on Mars because it's a god awful, god awful small affair. To the girl with the mousy hair. <laughs> oh, we are welcome back to Surviving Mars. And uh, look at that, I made $25.1 billion. Now, um, actually, oh, crud, actually, I gotta fix something here. Because it looks like my donation ticker moved back up over uh, all of my amount. So, if you want to just kind of pull that down a little bit, that should still be out of the way. Yeah, that's good enough. That's good enough. Two minutes late, I wasn't two minutes late. I was... Uh, An ant is on time wherever he is, whenever he is, at all times. Get things fixed. I was, I was just making sure everything was fixed. And 100%. How you doing, cat girl? Hope you're having a fantastic Saturday. Hope it's a heck of a lot warmer than mine is. I think right now it is 12 degrees. 12 beautiful degrees. So yes, we are back here in Mars on the beautiful red planet. We have our dome ready. It is being built. Let's get time moving, actually. The dome is being built, and we are getting nearly ready to start welcoming our first colonists. Hey, Vela! <laughs> How you doing today? How is my favorite rabbit, uh... <laughs> sure. My favorite, uh... I, I don't know what, like, a uh, rabbit would be a... I can't, I can't think of the scientific name for rabbits. <laughs> uh, but Vela teaches me all about rabbits, and she is our VIP, and I hope you're having a fantastic Saturday. I would also like to give a uh, shout-out to one of my mods. I want to give a shout-out to uh, Raven Vulcans for uh, just kicking ass through uh, Kingdom Hearts. We finished that uh, all today, and he is on his wait now for Kingdom Hearts 3. So, uh, congratulations, Raven. That was a long journey. And, uh, can't wait to see them start doing, uh, KH3. Good job, my friend. Alright. So, we're getting our, we have our oxygen tank built now, which is fantastic. That'll start filling with, uh, spare oxygen. I'm gonna have a polymer factory up and running momentarily. Uh, everything is going good. Also, emote! That it is an emote. I'm actually using a secondary mug today. Uh, don't worry, don't worry, the Doctor Who mug is fine. I'm using my uh, Shakespeare mug right now. With it, it's a Shakespeare mug with all of the uh, swears from Shakespeare. One of all the letters we received today comes from a lump of foul deformity, highly fed and lowly taught. Dear Penham, I am delighted to hear that your bolting hutch of beastliness. Not so much brain as earwax. I'm going to use a lot of these. These are going to be a lot of the slang I'm going to use. Huh? I'm going to bring uh, the uh, the old school uh, slang and birds back. Alright, so Take polymer is going to need workers. Love That's always. absolutely fine. And we are working Lee. on the casino complex. That is... Sleep. Please roll the next dog. Oh, we're out of electronics. That's the problem. That was my problem, wasn't it? Do you have any... You have three electronics. Good. Uh, are you transport? Good. Come over here and grab the electronics, please. Oh damn! That is also one of the Shakespeare. <laughs> if you if you read Shakespeare, I think Oh damn is actually literally in there. Uh, did you see the screenshot I showed you on Twitter? Um, I may have missed it. Give me just a moment. Give me just a moment. Let me take a look. Um, usually I close Twitter when I'm streaming, so I'll give me a moment here. Um. Oh yes, yes, I did see it. The one yesterday. <laughs> how it, how it literally unsubbed you. <laughs> that was, that was the most uh, awkward timing for, for it that could possibly happen. Uh, but don't worry, cat girl, it's all good. All good. Everything's good. We got you all set. <laughs> all right. Not a problem. Why are all my drones just? Uh, oh, there's nothing to do over here. That's probably why. Uh, the research site that we're uh, using for that. I have nothing over here I really want them to grab. Raven is here! And alive! 
Which is always two good things I like to hear from you, Raven, that you are here and alive. Uh, what do you need to fix? You need machine parts. <laughs> it was amazing. It was absolutely amazing. <laughs> oh, Vale, I love I love all your remotes. They're just very adorable. Um, you need metal or uh, electronics. So you pulled all the electronics on you. Let's pull some machine parts too. No, that there we go. Yeah, grab the machine parts as well. And I would like you to bring yourself up here. Are you on your way? Yes, he is. He is on the way. <laughs> oh, let's see. I mean, it's going. We got a new shipment. Too. Sector scanned. New shipment of some bird seed over at the conspiracy, which is a great friend of the colony here today. So we are almost to the point where um, we're going to be calling in. Oh, good. So I got some machine parts, electronics, and polymer on the way. Beautiful. I am going to need those. And I would like you to just dump your load there. Just unload everything. There. Beautiful. <laughs> so I hope everyone has had a fantastic and fun sun, uh, Saturday. Um, I spent mine indoors because we have a snowstorm going on in my area. So Lady Ant and I went nowhere today. And um, I made us a four cheese grilled cheese sandwich with a homemade tomato soup, uh, which actually came out pretty darn well, if I have to say so myself. And I will say so myself. Um, came out came out really really well. Uh, the picture is on Twitter if you want to actually see it. It is also on my Discord in the uh, food court, which is a new uh, area on my uh, on my Discord. Uh, I need to make a production. I need a rare metal extractor. Beautiful. And we're just going to plop you down right there. Simba got a new nickname today. Fantastic. What's the new nickname for Simba? Anomaly found. Oh, I found an anomaly. I found an anomaly because an asteroid struck. I don't think I can get up there, though. That's the problem. I don't think this guy can get over here. Any? Well, he is going to tr <laughs> My friend is going to try. <laughs> uh, thank you, Raven, for the links. Taking care of that. Yeah, I'm not really great at plating food, but it actually came out really delicious. <laughs> Alright, so they're going to start building on you for the rare metal. Chicken Nugget! Aw, oh, that's an adorable name. And our casino is up and running. Everything these people, I absolutely know. We have our hydroponics up. Oh, my lander's come. Uh, please to land right there. Thank you. I'm gonna need some dome construction. Dome. Home and education, living complex I have. I have uh, the base. Do I need, I don't need those yet. School, not yet. Research lab, maybe. Dome services. I got the casino, I got the grocer. I need, I need, I need, I need. The space bar? You know what? Let's, you know what? Mars needs booze. <laughs> uh, whereas, uh, they always said Mars needs women, Mars needs booze. That's the name of a movie. It's not me being, like, sexist or anything. It's the actual name of a movie. Uh, let's deconstruct you for some more supplies. Beautiful. And I think we can start as soon as this is built. I want to get, um, machine parts polymers. Did I not bring any metal with me? Uh, okay, so if I move this RC... What are you? Oh, you're metal. Okay. And you need... What do you need to make? You need five metal. Oh, right. But yeah, so we stayed completely at home today. Uh, we had those sandwiches and homemade tomato soup, and we watched, uh... Geostorm. <laughs> because I have a Gerard Butler collection. And I am not ashamed of that. I have two collections of two different actors. Uh, Gerard Butler and I have a Nick Cage collection of uh, Blu-rays. Again, not ashamed. 
Not ashamed at all. Oh. So, yeah, there we go. Okay, you're building. Let's start thinking of the personnel we want to get out here. We have 142 applicants. We can start filtering them down because I want to get some specializations in. Um, I'm going to need definitely a geologist, I'm going to need botanists, and I'm going to need um, the engineers. Oh, I wish I, I wish this didn't come in a full window. Close. Okay. I can't tell what that needs. So these hydroponics are going to need botanists to actually do the best job they can. Uh, he saw I woke up for a minute, uh, jumped on my bed and cuddled up to my legs and when I FaceTime my mom, I meant to call him Roasted Marshmallow instead I called him <laughs> Chicken Nugget. You know what? I like both. I, prefer, I really like both. Um, I don't think this place actually requires anyone of a uh, specific category to work there, so I'm not too worried about that. Uh, the diner, again, not going to need anyone. Uh, the grocer, not going to need anyone uh, specific to work there either. Uh, let's move you... A little bit like this way. I want to see if I can get them so they can grab these metals here because uh, we're running into a little bit of a uh, metal crunch. I used to call my cat Biscuit because <laughs> uh, she had like a toasted color to her. So that was her nickname. Her real name was uh, was Munchkin though, but I called her Biscuit. Cause I'm weird. <laughs> All right. All right. So let's think about the next thing we need to lay in here. Uh, they need concrete uh, transport. Uh, we have tons of concrete. I'd like to please come here and grab all that, please. Thank you very much. All right. Um, I might want to get down another moxie too, because my. I mean, well. I don't have any demand. Uh, actually, I do have a water demand. I produce three oxygen, have one demand, stored oxygen 138. I don't like how low these are, um, even though I do have quite a bit of things. Alright, so that's not what I wanted. Let's get you, because you're still cheap. This is Just load you up on metal. With Public Service Escalin. We have a sound yeah, load it right up on metal. For the blue sunset light. Bring all that metal in. Launch Friendship 1. And I am going to need names for my uh, first passenger ship, by the way. So uh, that is up for grabs. So that's going to be launched. That's on its way. Trust me, it's not weird. Sim has gone through more nicknames than twice. Excellent. Excellent. Can you reach... Can you just reach the stupid metal? That's all I need you to do is reach that metal right there. Are you in range? Finally! Alright, he's in range. Okay. So you're still going to need metal to finish and you still need concrete. You are full of concrete. Beautiful. Drop your load there, please. Uh, I'm just moving your own, aren't I? There we go. <laughs> okay, alright, alright. Trust me, I've played this game before. Once or twice. Excellent day. Excellent day. Great coffee today. Decided on the Tim Hortons uh, Colombian again. Because uh, I can't get out and get new coffee. <laughs> Even going down the road to Tim Hortons was going to be uh, so much of a hassle. Uh, the roads were horrible. And I live on a major shipping route. Um, right through, leads all the way through to uh, mid-New York. So you're heading out towards Rochester, Syracuse, all that. Um, and the roads were still horrible. It was ridiculous the way the snow was coming down. And it is still coming down, and it's supposed to last until tomorrow at noon or something like that. But we deal with what we have to do, right? When life gives us lemons, we make, I don't know, lemon pepper chicken or something. I don't like lemonade. I'm not a big fan of lemonade. Peach tea, though. That's where uh, that's where the jam's at. That is where, that's my jam right there. Yes, now they're finally going to get that metal. Beautiful. Excellent. So you're going to be able to get finished. You're now getting concrete. Um, 
Where are you taking that concrete, my friend? <laughs> He's just taking it away. That's you know what? That's absolutely fine. You can just guys. I, I left the concrete here for a reason. Quit taking it away. Uh, let's see what do we got here. Classic favorites are Simber Me Timbers, uh, Simber San, Orangey, Orange Football, and Wiggle Worm. <laughs> all all great names for cats. I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure the cat's just like, you know what, call me whatever. I don't care. Uh, so the grocer, probably get down maybe a dining social food. Drinking social, dining social. What does the grocer give? Both, uh, food and shopping. They distribute hot meals. The diner just serves flashy dishes. I really don't need that. I'd like to get something better for services. I could put in a water reclamation. You know what? That's not a bad idea. How much polymer do I have left? Um, you ate all my polymer. Where did you put all my polymer, you stupid robots? Uh, three... Okay, so put it back... Why'd you put it back there? You're weird. Uh, Alright, so if I want to make the spire... The water reclamation spire, I need ten. And I do have enough. And we will plot. Or I can make a statue. Which one should I make? A statue of myself or a water recl Like something useful, like water reclamation. <laughs> oh, choices, choices on that, huh? <laughs> make a statue? Alright, statue it is. Decoration. Statue. Right in. Oh, I can't make it right in the center. <laughs> Boo. Lame. That's a, that's a lame portion. In honor of the founder of Mars. I guess I can just... Oh, I can't even knock down that tree. Put myself, like, right there and make some parks. We'll put a park there. Alright, you know what? We'll, we'll wait on the staff. <laughs> Elon Musk it. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm putting Elon to shame here, so... Uh, we need to fill up this dome, though. We do need things to fill it up. Uh, probably an infirmary would not be a bad idea to uh, drop in here. So we can drop that, <laughs> fill it with ants. Raven, you are, uh, you're full of, uh, ideas. I think I'm gonna go with that word. I think that's the word I'm gonna go for. Uh, let's see. Rare metal extractor is almost done and being filled up. I think it's gonna be connections, if I remember correctly. Uh, you're up in the Discord now. <laughs> there we go. We need, uh, power cables. Let's run one right through all that rock. And, yep, right there. Oh, that connects there. Perfect. So I'm not going to worry about that anymore. So he is going to get power very, very soon. Resources are low. Yes, I know I am low. I'm getting them in fairly soon. It's 88% here. Um, I'm getting a lot of metal, at least. Machine parts are turning into a bit of an issue. Uh, down to 3 of 30. Uh, do I want to launch another one now? I got the money. Uh, let's start getting in some machine parts extra. I'm gonna need these extra things, so. If I bring some food already, that means I'll have stuff to live on while we're growing. Yeah, we'll bring some fru uh, fruit. <laughs> some food with us as well. Um, May is. I'm gonna be producing polymer, so I'm not too worried about that. Machine parts, though, are gonna be a problem. Launch that. We got two coming in. I'll take it. It's a it's a bit of a loss, but it is. Uh, let's see. Ideas and stupid. What? Who isn't full of ideas? I'm full of ideas and stupidity. That's me. Uh, let's get another dome project in here. We're going to need uh, love and marriage. That goes hand in hand. Al Bundy taught me that. Could make all right. The infirmary is going in. Maybe an electronics store. Latest gadgets or an art store for luxury shopping. But I do have that, and I don't have anything for luxury, do I? That consumes a polymer. You know what? Let's drop it in. How did you fit? There you go. So our dome is almost up. I'm going to leave this area open for apartments because we are probably really close to making our apartments. And 
And yeah. So they're actually already in production. So I'm not too worried. I'm full of caffeine and stupidity. That is 100% accurate, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, that is the tagline for my channel, so welcome aboard. I'm Antagonizer2000, I'm full of caffeine and stupidity. <laughs> the thug life! And thug life. I, I at least use, uh, I use creamer, uh, stevia, and thug life for my coffee. Hey, fucking guy, how you doing today? Welcome back to Mars. I got my off to Mars. <laughs> Alright, so what I want to do... I'm not producing any water because... I miss Mary Children so much, don't care what anyone says. Uh, because I'm probably full on all my water things, aren't I? Yeah, I am. Right. Avoiding the outdoors like a plague? No. I'm with you on that. Uh, I'm, with, I'm with you on that, guy. I am... Uh, I didn't go anywhere today because we're about to get about 14 inches uh, from 10... like 10 p.m. last night through tomorrow. We're gonna get about 14 inches. So we didn't go anywhere and the roads were garbage. Didn't even bother. Uh, this doesn't need any other connections. You don't have enough workers. Indeed, man. And I live on a major uh, shipping route, which always confuses me why the roads aren't actually uh, cleared out. Uh, how much more metal do we have there? Three more metal there. 42 on that. Alright, I think we're good. Let's... The infirmary is being built. The art store will be built very soon. Let's get uh, you over here and grab the polymers. Grab all those. Thank you very much. And let's start thinking people. Uh, we're going to need... Um, what's the best people for you? Oh, I can actually set. Uh, only specialists. Perfect. Uh, refresh my memory on what you got going on here. Just started a new game. Well, right now, uh, we have... We're pretty much at the point where we're going to start bringing people in. Uh, we got the rare metal, uh, rare metal extractor down. We got the dual uh, hydroponics up. We got the grocer. We have a medical facility coming in really soon. Uh, we have an art store in production. We have the casino, the space bar, the living quarters, and we're leaving a last spot open right there to drop the apartments, which are actually already in production. So, as soon as those are done, we're going to uh, drop some apartments on in there and try and get some more people on in. So, right now, uh, we're full up on oxygen and water, uh, so that's why our production is pretty low. And I think, I think it's time. Uh, Catgirl, how do you want me to say that? Uh, do you have fuel, uh, fuel, produ oh, fuel production? That's one thing I didn't have in the way. I don't think I actually built, oh, I don't have the fuel, per uh, uh, where is it? Not that. I thought, didn't I get fuel production? Thought I did. No G. Water reclamation. Drones. Drones. Extractors. Yeah, I might have to do it that way. Uh, let's let's just see if I can make one. Uh, production. Fuel refinery. I can make one. Ha ha ha. Uh, let's see. Consume. Cost. Cost a whole bunch of stuff. All right. Metals are a bit of an issue, not a problem though. Let's get you plugged in, maybe like right here. Yeah, that'll be fine. Yeah, I got one. I'll build that in. Not a problem. Not a problem. But I want to start getting people now, because uh, we're gonna need them to work it anyway, or uh, a lot of these things. My trans. I know my trans. Uh, I know. I know. I'm. I'm. <laughs> I'm working it. I'm working it. I was trying to describe everything to you, guy. <laughs> Cut me some slack here. Cut me some slack. I'm still I'm still a very big novice at this game. <laughs> no, it's it's all good. It's all good. Alright, let's break that down too. Get rid of that. Get rid of friendship one. Uh you want me to say it? Alright, say it in a soldier voice and end it with a nerdy twist. I'll give someone 14 inches of knowledgeable reading, of course. I don't know. Is that is that good enough for you, Cat? I'll give you 14 inches of... I'll give someone 14 inches of knowledgeable reading, of course. Ow. <laughs> I hit myself in the face. 
Uh, because I'm a genius. All right. Now, let's start thinking people. Passenger rocket. Let's do it. I want to filter right now. I want specialization. I want geologists, botanists. I want medics. I'm and you're listening to I want engineers. Your reliable 420 for stars. Beautiful. Have. Um... All right, let's focus on that right now. Uh, age group is no children, no seniors. We'll keep it at uh, keep it at adults. Yeah, our first one's gonna be adults only, and we're only gonna have men on Mars. No, we are going to have. Oh, we have no other sex. Oh. But I'm glad they do have an other sex option. You can't see it because my my giant head's covering it up. But I can drink. I can break it down to male, female, and other. Most games don't actually have that. Uh, perks, flaws. I, alcoholic, chronic condition, gambler, glutton, hypochondriac, idiot. I would not like idiots on Mars. That'd be fine. Mom says hi. Perks, hi, mom. Guru, I hope you're reading Cat Girl more memes. She wants to. She wants to hear all the memes read out loud. Uh, Jealous Botanist Engineers, I think that's what I had both of uh, To fill in the specializations I need. Um, officers... That might be on the second one. Right now, I really do need Jealous and Botanist. I want to get those filled in because I want to get the rare metals going back to Earth. Um, botanists, and maybe... Hmm. You know what? Scientists as well. Let's get them. Uh, those are the five we're going for. Scientists, geologists, engineer, and botanists and medics. So, we do have some good things in there, and we're trying to make sure we grab what we can. Selected, medic, engineer, engineer, scientist, botanist. I was just keeping the rare metals for now, you're gonna- Oh! Okay. You know what? I've never gotten that far. <laughs> Delicious. I need a place to put it. Back to the Doctor Who mode. One thing about surviving Mars is I burned through a lot of coffee. <coughs> I burned through a lot of coffee in this game. Even when I'm not streaming it, I burned through a ton of coffee. Uh, let's see. <laughs> uh, it is the only way to build electronics which you can- Oh! Okay. I did not know that. Maybe I should have read the electronics uh, stuff a little bit better. Where's my creamer? I put my creamer in the same place every time and I lose it. There we go. And both my mom and dad know what the dance move floss is, so I've disowned them both. That's okay, Raven did the same thing to his, uh... <laughs> he disowned his... <laughs> I, still, I still remember... <laughs> Asking people to floss, and they actually, instead of actually flossing, they actually do the dance, and then, you know, they're disowned from every family and every uh, group and organization in the world. <laughs> uh, he typically has killed all the colonists by now. This is all new stuff. <laughs> oh. You know what, Vela? Vela's absolutely correct. It's, it's true. Uh, my mortality rate in games is pretty intense. <laughs> Uh, let's see, we got two botanists coming in. That's good. I can get them more. Um, I think I want more botanists. How many scientists am I bringing in? I'm bringing in two medics. One, two, three engineers. One, two, three. One botanist, two botanists. I need another botanist in here. Let's take you out. I need a botanist. Uh, Protush, you're a scientist. Josephine Anton, you are a... Female adult from I think the U.S. Oh, France maybe. You're melancholy, but you're working. You're an alcoholic workaholic. Workaholic. Uh, killing people off before you even bring them in. <laughs> it is skills. I got mad skills when it comes to uh, body management. I guess <laughs> you could say. All uh, right. Um. Instead, I want more I um, the university and three bot I would love one more botanist to be honest with you. Um, its motion and its behavior in space and time. 
Leave one medic out. Grab another botanist, Martha. She's a gamer. I'm bringing a gamer with me to Mars. Alright, so what shall we name our first ship, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, he wants to kill everyone in a hospital two minutes ago. Schedule capture. Uh, she's not lying, uh, guy. She is not lying whatsoever. I literally killed everyone in the hospital because I, I overextended myself. My second hospital was actually a bit better. I gotta admit that. So, ladies and gentlemen, remember, there are no... Uh, donations, no bits, no subs, nothing required to name anything in games that I play for Paradox. Uh, if there is anything that you would like named, just let me know in chat, as long as, you know, it's, uh, just keep it cool, keep it, uh, you know, keep it respectful. <laughs> uh, the, the facepalm? The hashtag facepalm, sending it to Mars? The facepalm, <laughs> the hashtag facepalm. Going to Mars. Oh, I can't put the hashtag. Boo. Hashtag. Alright, too long as well. That seems weird that I can't do that. Uh, Alright, apparently uh, face palm would not work. Let's try uh, chicken simbun. Yeah, I get Apparently too long. Let's try just regular face palm. Why is nothing working for rename? Nothing's- I don't know why the, the rename's not working. Hmm. Well, alright, the game doesn't want to agree- doesn't want to agree with us, so, uh... Launching it. I guess we'll have to deal with it when it comes. We'll do it with the next one, I guess. Yeah, try it after it lands. Maybe that's it. Like you, your legion one of guy. Can I rename you? Face palm. That one renamed. Oh, uh, I gotta rename it though. I gotta put it back to what it was. Legion one of guy. There we go. I had to fix it. I had to, I had to return it to its rightful owner, which is uh, legion of I of guy, which is actually with a V. I misspelled it. That's my problem. And let's see, do we have the art store is almost done? Fantastic. RC transporter, let's get some more concrete moving this way as well. I got a feeling we're gonna need it anyway. Uh, let's lay down a storage depot. Um, that's fine. And what do we got? What do we got going on? I got a lot of things uh, being set. Try it after it lands. Um. And, oh yeah, that's what I wanted to put in here. Since I can't do the statue, we're putting the water vaporator in. Va va uh, water reclamation system anyways. We'll do that. That's what we'll do. Uh, you got a pod ready to land? Yes, I do. I saw it blinking as I was laying down my uh, water reclamation. So let's drop the pod right about there. Fantastic. So we have we actually have people on the way to Mars, everyone. We are bringing life to this dead planet. Well, dead besides the aliens, the ghosts of Mars, the uh, the ice tea, uh, the killer robots from uh, Red Planet. Uh, <laughs> uh, somewhere you can just hear a single tear from Legion because someone misspelled um. It's absolutely true. He's gonna, he's gonna like, Authorization he's gonna hit me. He's gonna hit me. Vela with the 500 Robo Bits! Thank you very, very much. Is that, is that for, uh, is that for our eventual death to the, uh, robots of Mars? Or is that because, uh, you feel that, uh, my people will advance enough where they will become, uh, more machine than man? Technically making us the Borg, and we then, you know, colonize and destroy the entire, uh, universe. I like to think that's the one. <laughs> thank you very much, Vale. I greatly appreciate it. 500 bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, those people are going to take a little while to get here. They got... Well, they're only at 23%. We... Ah! I gotta give you power. Hello. Power, 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 power. 
And speaking of power, I might want to think... Maybe it was just 500 bits. I'll never know, Mail uh, Your secrets. Your secretive. But I do appreciate it. I really do. Uh, what is that oddly satisfying machine? Would it be this one here? Oh. It's my slurm machine! This is where I make my slurm. <laughs> we need pipes. Uh, production, life support, and pipes. Uh, the, ah! Ah, uh, this one down here? That's my, uh, that's my concrete machine. There we go. Beautiful. They're gonna make the power. They're gonna connect that in. A whole bunch of things. The concrete extractor. I got two of them. And I have, like, a crap ton of concrete. Uh, let's unload some more resources back up here. That's fine. Uh, do you want polymer factory? I, yeah, I got one right here. I got one right here. Okay. I'm just waiting for workers to come on in. Yeah, you told you told me that last time that I played. <laughs> I, I do remember that one. <laughs> you warned me. <laughs> it satisfies your eyes? <laughs> Years ago! I know, I only play it one day a week, so... Um, so it's really special when I play it. That's kind of why I keep things uh, to one a week. It's so fresh and new when I come to it at the end of the week. Does it make you feel good, cat? Oh, hello. <clears throat> Our sponsor informs us, due to changes in the economic conditions that impact the prices of key resources will be increased. It turns out that even Mars is not beyond the reach of stock market hiccups on our mother planet. Uh, in fact, the import price of food will be increased by 100%. Ooh. Um, apparently I am not, I don't have either one of these. Price of increase finally 50, and understood. Nothing I can do about it. Nothing I can do about it. Thankfully, we are going to be producing our own food. Now, I was thinking, after we get the second set of people in, I wanted to make, um, where is it? The fungal farm. Uh, for more food production. And I think anyone can work at the fungal farm. Uh, far away it looks like a honeycomb. It does. <laughs> this this game uh, this game is absolutely fantastic. I, I love this game. Uh, Kat, the graphics in this are so wonderful. I mean, just the little things that they put in the game. There's signs you can barely see that <laughs> they added in. And it's lovely. It's absolutely lovely. And by the way, this looks like a casino in uh, near one of my cities, to be honest with you. Uh, how much are you down? You're 7 of 10 on polymers. I brought, I brought in a ton of polymers, didn't I? I think I'm out of polymer. Uh, I know I see the new anomaly. I see it, I see it, I see it. Go down here, grab those polymers. New anomaly. Where is it? Uh, where's my other dude? Come out here. I sent a rover somewhere, and I don't know if... No, stop that. I don't think he made it anywhere near here yet. Uh, if I was my rover, where would I be? This is Mars um, radio with not that. Yeah, where's my explorer? There he is, and he's stuck. Yep, he's not getting anywhere. <laughs> Alright, where did we find it? I found it over here. You know what? Go scan that anomaly. Uh, you. Get over there. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I figured he couldn't get up that hill. I just, I wanted to try, and when I clicked on it, it seemed like he could go, but he... I was like, okay, maybe he can make it over. Who knows? Uh, they wanted people to be visually pleased. They absolutely did. And they knocked it out of the park with this game, in my opinion. It's a very beautiful game. It's a stressful game, too, sometimes. Yeah, you need the tunnel. I I took a shot in the dark, guy. I took, a, I took an absolute shot in the dark on that. Uh, so, it happens. It happens. How full are you? You're 6 to 105. Not too worried about that there. Everyone's hard at work. I would like you to bring polymers back up here and make a drop. Beautiful. 57. They are more than halfway here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, let's, because we do have... You know what? It might not be bad just to get this down now. And then I can... Uh, yeah, I know. I know. 
I absolutely know, guy. Not sure what I can do about it, though. That's the only problem. Research lab, that's not going to do me any good. Dump service there. I'm going to have to keep on shipping them in, really. That's really my only, uh... The only thing I can do right now. Uh, build solar for now and a ton of batteries, yeah. Yeah, I was thinking my pop... Yeah, I'm already down to 8 on power consumption. That's probably not a bad idea to just lay down some panels. It's going to cost, again, more solar panel. Solar panel. There we go. Uh, let's see. Don't you uh, know there aren't easily controlled and a simple rock and flip? Uh, civil rock and flip the machine. That's right. Alright, so let's start building on those, and let's get a battery over here as well. Rotate that. Bam. Put that in. <laughs> and shut down the wind turbines, yeah. I'm gonna wait till these are up, and then I'm gonna drop these down. Um, I'll be taking those offline. Seven. Alright. My people have arrived! They've arrived! Oh, no, they haven't. Never mind. I clicked on the wrong... I <laughs> clicked on the wrong ship! <laughs> uh, uh, let's see. 62 over 49. So, 63 over 50. Right now. So, let's get these bad boys built. And I know we have a whole bunch of things on. The problem is my metal. I'm running into a metal issue. But I'm hoping that you're just going to produce rare metal. I need actual metal metal. Metal metal would be fantastic. Uh, 24 billion. You can tell us to send a rock. Yeah. For a planetarian? I did not know that either. Huh. The more you know. Thank you, guy. Good to know. Good to know. Uh, let's see, two or three. You are in construction. Beautiful. So as soon as you get up and... Am I paused? No, I'm not paused. Everything's moving. You're really running slow. That's alright. Come on, ship. 80%. They're almost here. And you are actually full of fuel, but you don't have anything on you. That's fine. That's fine. I'm going to wait together, uh, hmm. Probably sending you back, I could just load you full of people. Uh, you know what? Let's do that. Let's send you back to Earth. Head home. Uh, fight some metal with your transport. Uh, you know, I keep forgetting that guy. Thank you for reminding me. I keep on forgetting that my rover can freaking, uh, the transport can just go over here and start, uh, digging up metal. Absolutely 100% keep on forgetting. Ay ay ay. Get over here and dig that. Thank you. Thank you. You told me that last time, too, and I'm like, yeah, I'll do it. That's cool. That's a good, cool thing that I can do. Totally forgot. 100% forgot. <laughs> um, big dummy. Let's send you back to Earth. Go home. <laughs> Look at this robot. No! <laughs> and I launched a rocket from Mars, and I got 250. Beautiful. Alright, that solar panel is up. I'm going to shut you down. And I'm going to... Next one is building. And as soon as the other one comes back on, I'm going to shut the other one down there as well. That thing is going up. Wonderful. There goes my ship. There goes Legion of... <laughs> Legion of Guy into space. Where he belongs. He is the star child. All right, milestone. Yep, milestone. Thank you very much. Something weird on my screen. Uh, close the Sterling generator. Yeah. Uh, Sunday stream. Sundays are Stellaris Vela. Uh, so it is another Paradox game, of course, because <laughs> of course it is. And all we know is that I play Paradox games almost exclusively on the weekends now. Uh, so yeah, we're gonna be continuing with Puma Corp. And we are going to be looking to make friends with some neighbors, hopefully. And find some actual real people that aren't, uh... That really aren't, um... Fallen Empires. That'd be really nice. It'd be fantastic if I could find one of those. <laughs> now, oh, the 2%, and they're almost here. Uh, remember, um... 
Uh, Tuesday. Tuesday, Subnautica is back. Subnautica is back, and uh, I got a feeling I got to face my fears and go back to the ship. I'm not looking forward to that. Anomaly analyzed. Uh, let's see, I need one more polymer, huh? Can you, uh, what is dragging that polymer around? Research complete. And. Excellent. Uh, Alright, so we can now make our apartments. That'll probably be the next thing I'm going to drop down. Uh, we got some, uh, only two research in. Let's start working on. Uh, clearing of salvage and destroyed buildings. Decommission protocol. Uh, productivity training. That's good. I'm already doing that one, though. Extractor amplification consumes additional power, though. Um, yeah, drone. let's get drone, uh, drone swarm going. That'll be good. Anomaly has been we analyzed. just confirmed the location of a metal-rich deposit. A drilling accident turned to our advantage. Nice. So we have found a metal deposit, which I'm guessing was uh, this way. And where were we? Yep, there it is. Right up here. Right there. Underground metals. And it's right by a concrete deposit. Do we have any water? I mean, I can make evaporator out here. That's not a problem. But... Okay, we'll make two. I think this is kind of where we'll make our another uh, little sub-colony area. Which is good, because we also got some good vistas here, too. Uh, yep, that's going to be... Um, oxygen not included is on... Uh, Hellblades on Thursday. I'm going to do Oxygen Not Included on Friday, I think, this week, or next week. Uh, so next week is looking uh, Lord of the Rings Online on Monday, of course, as we do for Mondays. Uh, we're going to be doing um, Subnautica on Tuesday. I'm off on Wednesday. Hellblade, uh, Sinua's Sacrifice on Thursday, and Oxygen Not Included on Friday. So that is next week's schedule. So I hope everyone, uh, everyone's happy with that. And down come our folks! Yay! Let's land on Mars! Bringing them in. I should make a landing pad or something. Uh, people make so much better cities than I do, though, but, you know... Mine at least are, are semi-functional. Let's turn that wind turbine off, too. And while those people are landing... Let's get a supply ship in. Um, let's mix some food in. Uh, you can make a trade route. Oh, okay. Again, thank you for the thank you for the hint, uh, guy. Like more things I didn't know. Uh, just bring in a whole bunch of that. I just lost that. People are coming down. You're full there. Aha! Transport route. Excellent. Oh, and you can load from a large area, too. That's cool. Alright, so let's bring them home first. Let's bring all this, uh, all the resources in. Uh, just drop it all right there, and then I think I'll have him grab from right here. So he's gonna bring those in. Excellent. Thank you very much, my friend. Uh, Lotro is a favorite MMO for sure, yeah. So, uh, next week is actually gonna be a very Vela-heavy, uh, very Vela-heavy, uh, nice. week with, uh, Love Games. Which uh, is not a problem because I love them all too. I spent a whole bunch of extra time on uh, Oxygen Not Included, so I think I got it a bit more. I think I'm gonna play it tonight after uh, after my stream too. I'm gonna play it. I, I miss it. It was actually really really fun and really really cute. I love the uh, the actual people themselves. New colonists have arrived. And we do have a battery being built over there. Fantastic. Uh, but it does need look. I'm in a polymer pinch too. Crap, I didn't load any polymer on this thing. Um, just bring me a crap ton of polymer right now. Thanks. I know I'm, I know I'm spending money like a mad fiend guy. I know you're probably ripping your hair out right now. Just bear with me. <laughs> just bear with me. I'm doing, I'm doing the best I can. Full of hope and determination, the first founders have set foot on the red planet. There we go. The next ten souls will be full of difficulties and dangers. Um, but also with great promise and opportunities, it is now up to us to prove that Mars can be a doorway to greater riches and the future of the human civilization. 
Even the most epic adventures started again with a single step. The effect, the arrival of a colonist, blah, blah, hint, the colony will be evalu evaluated possibly for the period ends the event of the first human is born. Uh, which means I would need a nurse. Yeah, that's exactly what I was thinking. Uh, I'm like, I have the money. May as well spend it now. <laughs> so we'll get uh, get those ships in here and you have finished dropping your load. That was an awkward way for me to say it. I'd like you to go over here and load resources there. Uh, metals. And then I'm guessing this is unload. Yeah, unload right. Yeah, just unload right there. It's fine. Perfect. So he's going to make that route, gather up all that junk. Beautiful. And I just... Durr, load. Metal. Unload. Do it. <laughs> I always do that. It doesn't have enough... Sun, uh, the sun's down. <laughs> and, uh... Ah! Uh, I moved my camera. I gotta fix my camera. How did I rotate my camera? <laughs> I forgot how to rotate my camera. Hold on. Uh, options... Controls. Uh, Alright, I'm too close. I'm way too close to the ground. Can, I, can we fix that? Thank you. Come on. Stop, stop it. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. How did I, how did I do this? <laughs> That's a radio station. Oh, oh, hold on. I broke something. Uh, Keybinds. Ah, that's W and S, pan up and down. Uh, home, home resets camera. Uh, home. Ah, <laughs> I'm, I'm a winner of games. Yes, I know my resources are low. We have nine days to get everything in. Fantastic. We can rotate. Um, oh, I started a new game in Monster. I'm sorry, Bill, I'm way behind. Uh, I think you'll like Hellblade. Yeah. Uh, like I said, Lady Ant was playing it, and she, uh, she thinks I'll also like it. Uh, she says, always make sure I wear my headphones in this game, uh, because it's very atmospheric. Uh, let's turn it back on. Negative 17 on power now that everyone's using it. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes absolute sense. All right. Uh, you should load all sometimes, and then you can fill polymer so you have. You, my friend, are refueling. So, let's turn your boat back on right now. Uh, we're going to need the power, negative 12 on power. <sighs> Go ahead. I know, I know, guy, I know that was a bad thing to probably do, but I didn't do it yet. <laughs> Resources build, build me are low. One. Yes, I know my resources are low. I have a ship coming. <laughs> I know, I hear you yelling. I hear everyone yelling. Everyone abandoned me and everyone left. <laughs> Even Raven left me. <laughs> oh my. Alright, so my power production is a little draining. You know what I can probably do? I can probably stop concrete production from now. Um... Just for the simple reason, I have a 900 billion things in concrete. So, uh, power storage is 527. So, I mean, we're not hurting. We're not hurting on power. Yeah. But concrete, I'm full on it. Don't need it anymore. So, don't have to worry about that. People are going to be hard at work. Let's make sure everyone is working where they should. You are a botanist working there. You are... Where's my other botanist? Oh, I need to make an apartment complex. Um, domes, I need an apartment. Spin you. Hit, there we go. Bam, drop that in. Uh, because what I'm going to do, as soon as this ship uh, gets back to Earth, we're going to load that one up with more people, and we're going to start uh, getting more workers in here. Because right now I only have one. I have an alcoholic who's hungover. Radoslav Dmitriov, uh, she's working there. Uh, by the way, would anyone like to be a, uh, a colonist on Mars? <laughs> would anyone prefer to be? I can definitely make that for you. Uh, we are making leafy crops right now. Fantastic. Uh, who's working here? You're a scientist working in the art store. 
Alright. Uh, medic is working where you should. I have a botanist and an engineer working there. That's probably um, not what you should be doing, to be honest with you. Oh, you don't have... Like, literally, it doesn't have any power. I'm sitting here like, yeah, I don't... <laughs> I'm sitting here thinking like, oh, it's because I'm in the negatives and it doesn't have any power. I just noticed it doesn't have any freaking cables attaching to it. I'm dumb. There we go. Let's let's uh let's fix this. There we go. Uh, you want to be a scientist? You got it. <laughs> that was the, that was idiotic. Oh my. I think you were working at the art store. Would you like a male or a female scientist as soon as I can find them? Botanist. Let's see what I got for scientists. Geologist. Botanist. Scientist. Um, apparently I don't have... I only have one scientist and it is a uh, alcoholic female. Would you like to be a... Uh, on Earth, I used to listen to Bach. I think she's, uh, no, she's not an alcoholic. After I, landed uh, on Mars, my musical I could, I could, you can name Guy. I'll tell you what, the next ship that comes back, I will, uh, name a male no, scientist after you. <laughs> I'll wait, I'll wait. No, explanation <laughs> to this phenomenon. Take care. no worries, no worries. That does sound like a similar experience. Alright, so this should be a really nice supply drop coming in, too. In the meantime, uh, we do have enough food there. I need that ship to get back to Earth. So I can get my next set of colonists in. Uh, Raven Stream can allow us a lot easier to control the mouse. Yeah. Um, Monster Hunter World is a uh, game that I still have on my wish list. I had the opportunity to buy it, Vela, and I was like, oh, but Mega Aquarium's on sale, and then Parkitect was on sale. And then, uh, Empires of the Undergrowth was on sale. And I'm like, oh, there's so many games, and the game was still on, like, $60 when I was looking resources at it. Resources are low. Yes, I'm working on the resources are low issue. Because I have another ship coming down, full of polymers, you stupid robot. <laughs> Break that down. Now we are full on machine parts there. Beautiful. Beautiful. And you need polymers. Yep, you're coming down with all the fun stuff. Uh, but yeah, so Monster Hunter World is definitely what I want to do. I saw Puma uh, stream it a whole bunch of times. It looks absolutely fun as heck. Um, can you do that? Well, I do have a little bit of room. I mean, I could put it, like, right there. I do have the electronics. And I got the polymers. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Vela, with a kick-ass idea. I'm putting one in there. I know I could probably have made like a little park or something there, but you know what? It's small enough and it can fit. And uh, you can't manufacture electronics yet. I, I know. I know. <laughs> I'm still gonna have to keep on sending to Earth for them. Uh, that's my that's gonna be an issue, but I'm sitting on 23.5 billion dollars. We'll make it work. I'm, I'm like Elon Musk. It'll work. Don't worry about it. My stocks went up. <laughs> we'll make it work somehow. Have you? All right, he's still bringing in all kinds of metals, which is wonderful. Which are actually all being used. Uh, how far are we on you? You're being built. Wonderful. And the water reclamation is going in. You still need polymers, which are coming in now. Wonderful. And the Sterling Generator has been made. Let's open you up, and you're going to make uh, huge amounts of power for me. Oh, plus 20. That is, that's glorious. That's gorgeous right there. And you're almost back to Earth. That's fine. Um, I know my load's heavy around there. Building's not working. What do we got not working? Oh, my uh, concrete. Uh, gun um, your, uh, this one's still refueling, but yes. Yes, I am. Um, I need... I gotta wait. I gotta wait on the passenger rocket. Ooh. Alright, so I'm gonna wait till this guy refills, then I'll send him out to, uh, an ex expedition. Just gotta wait for fuel, guy. Just gotta wait for fuel. Uh, Vela, would you like to be, um, 
Oh, does it? It said, well, it still says, uh, oh, that's for Return to Earth, okay. Uh, well, I'm at 14, so, <laughs> one more fuel, then we, then we can take it out, guy. Vela, would you like to be named something, by the way? Would you like a, uh, scientist, a botanist, a medic, anything named after you? I got a whole bunch of people. You can be a botanist, a geologist, a scientist, an engineer, or a medic. Take your pick. And then you can, uh, you're, well, I mean, that's Vela Bot. Now we can have actual Vela. It's the, it's the robot you sent to Mars to, uh, understand how things are going. You're like Val Kilmer in Red Planet. Uh, you know, you said you came in with the robot. Uh, hey, nerd. <laughs> nerd! Uh, what kind of mic you use? Uh, a cheap one from Amazon. <laughs> one that I got, uh, because I was like, hey, I'm new to streaming and I didn't want to spend a lot of money if I failed and fell on my face. And <laughs> this is it. <laughs> Uh, it was like $23 on sale. <laughs> and that's me. Uh, what are you doing? Am I just, like, dragging my transport around right now? I think I am. No, he's just dropping things off. But yeah, that is, uh, that's what I use. <laughs> Thank you. Now, put me on the spot, Doom. Thanks a lot, man. <laughs> What's up? I am here. It's me. Ooh, antagonizer. And by the way, next month, everyone, you actually get to see my eyes because I'm getting new glasses. <laughs> so I no longer seem like a beat. I, I know. I no longer look like uh, uh, Mitch Hedberg. I'm a fat under G with glasses. A very like fat Mitch Hedberg, though. Um, <laughs> I guess a lot too. Uh, <laughs> So everyone is hard at work doing their job. Billy's not working five. Oh yeah. Is it because everyone's sleeping? Yep, we're on second shift. Um, I'm gonna go build my own theme park with blackjack and hookers. In fact, forget the park. Here I got ten on a Yeti for you. Go get one. Ten on a Yeti? Doom, thank you for the ten dollar donation. I didn't know Yetis were ten dollars. <laughs> to be honest, I've looked at Yetis before and I thought they were a lot more. Uh, a second here. Hold on one moment. Thank you very much, my friend. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, it's definitely, um, uh, but now you can get one at Sam Asher Guitar. Actually, all the guitar centers in my area have closed. Uh, there was actually one down the road, probably about 20 minutes away. Uh, closed down, unfortunately. So, uh, I'll probably go through their website, but thank you very much, my friend. Actually, um, I can probably do that next payday now. Sector scanned. Uh, with uh, everyone's generous help uh, with what's been going on. So I really do appreciate it. Uh, <laughs> are you are you saying my mic's not good enough, my friend? <laughs> no, I, re I really do appreciate it. I really do. No resources. Too. All right. Eight more days until we can start bringing more people in. Fantastic. How are you on fuel? I can send you... There we go. Activate. Um, what about you? Uh, yeah, let's, uh, send that expedition. 12 hours. Beautiful. And off we go. This is did uh, the Hold on. The name did take. It's d d d d this Alright, we're fixing that. Rename the rocket. We're gonna rename it what we said before. Um, I'm saying it's the one thing that doesn't match the quality of the rest of the stream. <laughs> Thank you very much. Well, I mean, I am gorgeous. <laughs> uh, I really do appreciate it, Doom. Uh, yeah. The, the mic has always been on my list of things that I need to need to get this year. So we're going to rename this to Face Palm. The Face Plum. There we go. I can spell. So hopefully... There we go. It is now fixed. Beautiful. Good things going. Uh, let's see. You handsome? I am handsome. You handsome! You're handsome, Florida man. Uh, let's see. I'm sending you a link. Yeti plus Assassin's Creed Origin combo on sale for 80 right now for a limited time. I will have to take a look at my uh, finances, uh, but I believe I can do it uh, because I didn't go anywhere <laughs> and spend any money today. 
Uh, besides, I threw a whole bunch of uh, subs at Puma. <laughs> that's really that's my spending I did for today. So usually I spend a lot of money on a weekend. Buildings are not working. Not working, not working. And who else is not working? Oh, my water reclamation. Oh, you need people. Gotcha. Let's turn off those shifts because uh, nobody's there. <laughs> I really do appreciate it. I will take a look after the stream, Doom. Thank you, my friend. I will, uh, I'll be joining the illustrious Club of Yeti. Why aren't you going anywhere? I'm gonna go build my own theme park with blackjack and hookers. In fact, forget the park. Here's Nut, you're almost halfway there. Thank you very much. Again, Doom, $20 donation. I do appreciate it, my friend. You don't have to. I, you really don't have to, but I really do appreciate it. Uh, I will... Now, that is definitely something that I can get done. And hopefully... Uh, by this time next week, I will have a, uh, <laughs> I already did it, mf -er. <laughs> I will, uh, have a brand new mic. Uh, oh, it needs the transport. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. How much, uh, more metal do you have? 26? Um, let's just have him then unload. Do that. <laughs> Drop a flush one. I think I should name that my next ship. <laughs> Uh, right. So yeah, let's get him. Uh, I didn't know he needed the transport. Thank you for letting me know, guy. I did not know on that. So I'm gonna have him drop his metal off and bring him over here. Uh, it'll do it automatically. Just be patient. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm just. I broke up the little uh, transport route that it was doing. Um, the problem is the waiting for that eight solar days uh, is annoying uh, to get more people, and my batteries have broken. <laughs> That's not good. That is not good at all. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, as Doom said, I mean, my mic quality is probably not the best. Um, <laughs> it's definitely uh, was high on my list of new things. Actually, I have a list on Amazon. I was like, all right, what do I need for streaming? And it was the, uh, if you have a Martian born, you don't have to, yeah, I'm, I find, I can get, I gotta get somebody born though. That's the problem. And to do that, wouldn't, I need the nursery, wouldn't I? Yeah. Place for them to live. No? They just... Oh, they just get born. Can I force people to have sex on Mars? Is that, like, a thing? <laughs> Can I have people get freaky on Mars, please? That'd be great. Alright. Uh, are you unloading? You're done unloading. Please bring... No, don't load... Why are, lo why are resources being loaded on the ship? <laughs> Uh, let's see. <laughs> I don't think... What's the overall comfort at? Uh, where would comfort be? Um... Ah, here we go. Births are allowed. Consumption. Health. Sanity is good. Comfort. Comfort is at 65. Uh, mostly because nothing's working at this time of night. Uh, it's still, well, early in the morning, I should say. Uh, not you. I want you. You. I would like you to move on there. No, I don't want you to move any resources. Just go. Um, what kind of payload does he need? He's not even bringing himself over. Yeah, I'm at 65 right now, so maybe we'll get some uh, hot Martian action going on. Alright, transport, just... No, just... What are you doing? Stop! I don't want you to load anything. I just want you to move. That's all I want you to do. Just move. No, don't load. Just... Come this way. Oh, wait a minute. I'm sending the wrong thing, aren't I? <laughs> oh, you need 35 fuel? Okay. Wait a minute. They can only... Oh. Gotcha. And the RC transport. I'm loading in the right thing, aren't I? Bring them over the right car. I think. I think my radio just died on the game. <laughs> That's alright. Uh, where is... Where did he go? Did he cut through the city? I lost my train... <laughs> I lost my truck. <laughs> You're listening to Mars official radio with Panama. Where the hell did he go? First radio host choice with the best radio voice. I lost him. <laughs> ah, there he is. He's just hanging out over there. I uh, just move over there, buddy. There we go. Uh, uh, the drones are unloading fuel. Give it time. Give it time. Yeah, not a problem. I'm not. I'm not too worried about how long that's going to take. It'll take its sweet time. So everyone is going to work. Beautiful. 
Uh, if you want me to get a second shift? Uh, yeah, let's actually have the casino as a uh, late night position. Casino's going to be open late night. The space bar, you're not going to be open in the morning. You're going to be open in the afternoon. There we go. You have one worker there. You have one worker there. The art store, you don't need to be open too a few times. Polymer factory, um, I kind of want to move somebody over and get them into another shift here. Uh, it is producing uh, 0.7 per turn uh, because I only have one worker there, so it's a little bit of an issue. Um, I just need some people to start humping my city. That'd be fantastic. Um, Alright, damn, their comfort's gone down. Complete. Um, what can I build that would increase comfort? Decoration? Yes, it does. And I could just drop a... There we go. Drop a little park in there. You can take your little, your uh, favorite lady there. Have yourselves a great time, you know. You can go to the space bar. Treat her to a uh, space lobster dinner at the casino. Uh, it is all-you-can-eat shrimp day at the, the space casino. It is fresh uh, delivered from uh, Earth. So Give me one moment. I'm just getting my coffee ready here. We're about half a pot down. <laughs> Gooner! How you doing? How you doing, Gooner? Hope the snow's, uh, snow's all right in your area. <laughs> it's still snowing out here. How you doing, my friend? Welcome to Mars. Mm, coffee. Delicious coffee. Have the Tim Hortons coffee going. Productivity training is done. So that would have been our, that was the, uh, which one was that? That was, ah, geologists, uh, have 10% performance. Fantastic. Yep, let's get that done too. Uh, it's a lot of snow to say the least. <laughs> to say the very least, it is a lot of snow. Uh, that, that fucking guy, uh, here, and, uh, Gooner and I know all about the snow that's going down right now. <laughs> Uh, let's get, yeah, let's get the mission protocol, and let's get our physics on the move as well. So, we'll just load up on all of that. That's fine and dandy. We're putting in a park, which apparently needs concrete. I know our concrete's over here. You know what? Just go over here, load up all that concrete, bring it over here. Um, I don't know. Uh, let me take a look. It's pitch black out. I can't, I can't see a damn thing. <laughs> I'm I'm ready for spring to hit because my god I'm tired of it being dark, just pitch black at six pm. Uh six to eight inches? Yeah. Yeah, that's about right. Um they're predicting fourteen out where I live, so not not exactly the most fun thing, but then again I'm not going anywhere. I'll stay home. I'll stay home in game. It's good enough for me. Uh, you. How far are you? You're 28 to 35. Fantastic. You're loading up on concrete. Wunderbar. One building is not working. That would be our grocer. That's fine. We'll turn the second shift off for now. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. Everyone's hard at work. Our food, we sold 124 food. Our botanists are making... My alcoholic botanist and my uh, non-alcoholic botanist <laughs> are producing food at 8.7. Fantastic. For crop growing. Wonderful. Uh, you can have me take the uh, food. Do I have food on the rocket? Oh, I still have 30 food on there. I didn't even realize I had stuff on there. I was wondering why I was telling me to load things. Wunderbar. Wunderbar. Tim Horton's coffee is never a thing to go wrong with. Huh? I will tell you that. Alright. Get all that concrete down and we will unload that food. Drop it. Beautiful. Hard at work. I have no ships coming. Still eight days. Nobody's been humping in Mars yet. A little, sh a bit of a shame. 
two people working at the space... Do I want two people working at the space bar, to be honest with you? A scientist, Meteor I could... Incoming. Uh... No! Oh, come on! Uh, bots, I would like you to get to work. I need, uh, need you to be fixed. Can we hurry up and, uh... Where's all my- all my metals are all the way over here! <laughs> no! Come here, grab some metal! Faster, boy! Faster! Oh, come on! Uh, you might want to tell your rockets to not export rare- Oh, that's actually a good idea. Another good idea? Another good idea, let's, uh... Where can I do that? Oh, uh, take your uh, commander to the league. Uh, my robots, I think, are uh, on the way to fix it. Where's my command? Where the hell is my commander at, too? There he is. All right, he's loaded up with metals. Just bring him over here and unload. Right over here. Now. Oh, he's already on it. Yeah, look at that good little robot. That's a good robot. You're going to be renamed. You're no longer drone number six. You're you're my helper for the stream. You're uh that fucking drone. There we go. Until we get the actual you down here, uh, fucking, we're gonna name a drone after you. <laughs> so he'll fix that. Fantastic. Let's get those medals down there though. So he'll bring them down. Okay, we're we're fine. We're absolutely fine. <laughs> Leak detected, pipe leaks zero. Fantastic. And are you still coming down there with metal? Yeah. We're gonna go fix the power cables, no problemo. We're going to drop just drop it right here. Drop it like it's hot. And are you gonna change your path? Yeah, come over here. Come this way. Get the resources in there. Thank you. Alright, go over here. Uh, load resources of that. Put everyone hard at work. Beautiful. So, while I was fixing an emergency, has anyone decided to uh, go to the bar and, you know, see a little romance? You, you ladies? Lieutenant Tuvok, are you, uh, would you like to do something? Apparently not. Uh, do I have food storage? Uh, actually, right now I think it's on my Universal. Right, and they're full. That's, uh, that's good thing to look at. Um, let's get a depot. Food. Food! There we go. I do now! So, there. <laughs> I do now! It's, uh, it's been done. Mm -mm -mm. So, are my wires are still getting fixed? Not a problem. Is that the last cable? That should be the last cable fault, hopefully. Hopefully. Are you almost done? Performing maintenance. Hopefully that'll be done. Alright. This is the Mars official radio. I'm Penham S. Unbiased information is essential to proper development. Still, people find it hard to understand that skewed information corrupts their conclusions. In context of social importance, like in the Mars Project, information has to be undistorted and addressed without preconceptions. With scientifically based information, the most difficult I love Mars can radio. be settled without issue. And that's my ambition with this radio show. To report indisputable facts in between good songs. Mm, like this one, it. for instance. Fix that fault. There we go. All right. Power consumption is back where it should be. I was a, a touch nervous, to be honest with you. <laughs> All right, what do we need? What do we need? What do we need? What do I want? What do I want to get down? I'm gonna need more power production. I believe. Let's get more solar batteries in on the ground here. There we go. I have a nice little solar field uh, in this location. Be a really good idea. Concrete, we're still really, really fine on. So. And we have people on Mars. I mean, technically I could end right now and we have a very successful stream. 
A very generous stream, I should say. So thank you, everyone. It's a all the outpouring. It's always fantastic. Uh, you couldn't valves isolate leaks. Oh, okay, okay, cool. Yeah, you know what? I've never. <laughs> again, it's because I've never really gotten that that far into uh, really this far into the game. Uh, well, really beyond here. So I never really got to the point of actually needing valves. I was always like really a stickler for building up really high uh, resources. So I'd have like uh, like 70 uh, <laughs> electricity and just like so much life support and uh, power and uh, oxygen, uh, water and oxygen built up that I would never have to worry about it. Uh, that is 97 to 100. But yeah, this one, uh, I'm a little bit uh, in uh, unfamiliar territory right now. Oh, it's not a problem. I appreciate it. I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. No need to apologize. Not a problem at all. I got a lot of food down here. Holy crow. <laughs> that is a ton of food. Alright. I'm handcuffed by that. By that right there. What's my comfort at right now? Comfort is at... 62. Everyone's working. Everyone's working for the weekend. Nothing much I can add, though. I'm all out of room. My apartments are built. Everything in here has been built and is fantastic. Uh, you're recycling up to 70% of the water used in the dome, which is a beautiful sight. Fantastic again. Hydroponics is working as fast as they can. Uh, since, uh, are you ready to go? Ah, there you go. Uh, take the food and... Uh, I don't want you to load it. I want you to unload. Unload. There. Beautiful. And we'll get the rover inside, or the transport inside the ship, and we will blast that ship off. Alright. Bing, bang, boom. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, so, uh, besides the mic, which I'm probably going to end up getting exactly as I said right after the stream here, uh, my next thing I need to really get is lighting. Uh, I'm using uh, these lights that I bought. Here, I can show you. Uh, these things, they're little touch lamps. <laughs> and uh, they're like $11 out of my grocery store, and I, I couldn't... For the life of me, I couldn't find anything in my local area for uh, a good lighting, and uh, my entire my entire apartment is dark wood, <laughs> so the light uh, doesn't shine that well around, and I don't have like real direct light direct lighting where I am, so I had to make do with what I had. So I'm actually looking at the uh, some uh, professional lighting uh, that I found on Amazon because that's what I do. I just look on Amazon for everything. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I have a desk lamp, but the problem is if I turn it towards me... Hi! I am now, like, Lilith, Lilith Stern from Frasier. I have no skin pigmentation. <laughs> like, I suddenly turn into, like, a ring ghost, so... Um, I'd prefer <laughs> not to use that lamp. Uh, you know, something like right, uh, like right here, like right here, up there, would actually be perfect, but, yeah... I found a couple things, uh, guy, that I'm looking at too, so. It's all, and that ship is off, and he is heading towards, 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 something I can't see because I can't get a plan to review. Uh, where am I now? There we go. Okay. Alright, and we're still doing really, really great. Um, our auction and life support, our production is spot on, I might want I'm tempted I'm really tempted to make some more water production I'm sorry uh, yeah water production I'm producing 3.4 and my demand is 3.4 I do have 300 stored but that I don't know if that's enough I, I mean I could drop another water production in here if I wanted to it's tempting or I could just make more storage could do that you know what let's make some more storage just to be on the safe side uh, life support. I would like another water tower, please. There we go. Uh, when the rock gets back, uh, you can tell it's take not your not the rare metals. Yep. And that is precisely what I'm gonna do, my friend. I have my grand total of one rare metal because I only have one geologist, and 
She's a raging alcoholic. <laughs> you know what? As you are, if I guess if you're sucking Mars and you're on a piston pump on an alien planet, it happens. Uh, let's get more power accumulators down as well. Let's get more one in here. Would be a bad idea at all for more power storage. I do have 800 stored up. I'm producing 103 over 73. So we're not in very bad shape. But what I'd like to do is... Probably... Yeah, I know. I moved them down before the stream. So it, they would make it easy. I thought it would make it easier for everyone to actually see how things are going up here now. <laughs> see, I, an old dog learns new tricks every once in a while. <laughs> Uh, let's get... I still have the money. Let's just get another supply pot. I'm gonna need more machine parts and electronics coming in, so I'm not too upset about spending the money now on them. Um, yeah, let's get those in. Metal's fine. Everything else is fine right now. And... <laughs> I'm bringing Legion... <laughs> Legion... I gotta, I gotta fix this now. So we just, uh, Legion 1 of Guy. Let's bring him there. There we go. Launch that. That's returning back home. Wonderful. Uh, what are my mission goals again? Mission goals. Mission goals. You know what? That is a uh, that is a good, honest, hardworking question. Um, what are ah? There we go. Um, let's see. Thirty colonists. A Martian-born colonist. Uh, I already done all that. Let's see. Uh, this, I guess, <laughs> is is what uh what it is. Generates uh that for soul, half time Martian board specialist, things like that. So like I said, I kept it a very basic game for uh, this run. And I mean if we end up like if we end up uh failing out of this one, we'll just start up another colony and take everything I learned from this run and uh apply it to the new one, uh that we have to. So I'm not too worried uh, if this one fails. Failure is nothing but an opportunity to see, succeed again. Um, that's kind of my motto for 2018. All right, 18? <laughs> I don't even know what year it is anymore. I drank so much coffee, I time traveled. Uh, 2019. There we go. <laughs> this is Mars' official radio. With I time traveled. I gained 31. Right Ooh, hello, 31 money. Um, yes, I gained 30, I think 30, it's 31 rare metals that I got. Yeah. Nice. I got it on my, uh, yeah. Beautiful. And Legion 1 of Guy is returning. And Doomster deserves something named after him for his, his, his super generous donations. Um, we're going to name somebody on the colony after him. He's going to be one of the first residents on the planet. Um, and I'm going to make him, no, Lawrence, no, 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 Lawrence, I'm sorry, you're being renamed, renamed colonist, sector scan, anomaly found, dooster fire, perfect, there we go, and going to uh, send another plant, yeah, uh, as soon as it ref uh, refuels, I'm going to send it back out, uh, in the meantime, I'm going to send him back out to gather these, uh, metals, because even though I have 50, we're going to need a lot more. Metals are going to be in extremely high demand. Uh, just with how much it's kind of running low. So. There we go. Yep, start moving things around. Wonderful. Everyone get to work. Yeah, 52%. So it's on its way back. Not fun. New anomaly found over there. And can I reach that one? I can! I've just had you sitting there. I should probably have you doing things. Uh, yeah, I'm waiting for that to come in. <laughs> Vela, um, do you, I still ask you, I'm still uh, waiting for an answer on you. Is there something you would like me to name after you? Would you like to be one of the first colonists? I know I have the robot, but would you like to be one of the first colonists as well? I can make you a botanist if you want, if you ever wanted to be a botanist. I could evict someone for you. I don't really want to do that. Uh, let's see. You know what? I'm going to name someone after you, Vela. You deserve it. You absolutely deserve it. Josephine? No, no, no. Josephine, I'm sorry. You are now Vela. And Vela, you work at the Art Museum. 
No, you're actually visiting the art museum, sorry. You're uh, just hanging out, looking at all the uh, wonderful artwork. And unless somebody starts uh, getting frisky, uh, guy, we're going to have to wait a little bit longer <laughs> to bring you in, to bring uh, bring you on the planet. Uh, let's see, let me just take a look through, a uh, quick look through here who's showing uh, on the channel right now. Raven! Raven is hanging around. Let's, uh, let's make Ra Ah, oh, there we go. Raven. Daniel Christensen. No longer. Raven Vulcan. There we go. Hopefully you don't die on Mars. <laughs> and the ship has returned. Wonderful. Bring it down right there. We're going to let you refuel and we're bringing you back up. So as soon as that gets down, my supply ship is on its way. Uh, with 15 machine parts and 10 electronics. Mm. I'll tell you, when I made that grilled cheese, I made it with four cheeses uh, today, and I mean, I thought the hardest thing was going to be uh, making tomato soup from scratch, uh, but weaving cheese and keeping it weave, huh, like weaved on the toast, making, I, I, I usually never make sandwiches in parts. Uh, what am I researching? I am researching currently uh, magnetic filtering to increase oxygen production right now. Uh, <laughs> I did, Vela, and you know what? I honestly thought about dropping two bits uh, just to take that lead back again, but you know what? I'm giving it to you. You can have it. That's your lead. You deserve it. <laughs> I'm Pana I'll give I'll give them bits next week when it resets to zero. I'm <laughs> um, I'm I try to be very very generous. Uh, yeah. Well, it was. Let's see. It was Havarti. It was... Let me pause real quick. It was Havarti, it was Gouda, it was... Munster, and it was Colby. So those were the four cheeses I put into it, and what I do is I weave it, kind of like a, like a quilt, and then what I first do is I uh, cook the Texas toast, make sure it's nice and crispy, put the toast on it, or the cheese on it, after I flip it, put it back in the oven, let it, uh, let it cook, let it melt, and, you know, bam, you have a sandwich together. Serve it with some pepperoncinis. Oh, it was out of this world. Out of this world. First time I made it that way, too. But it was it was a complicated sandwich. And a lot of cheese left over, too. All right, so you're going to refuel. Fantastic. I'd like you to actually pull you. Load resource. Can you not take the resources off? Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. Before I do that. Allow forbid. I want to forbid. That's what I want to do. Ah, see, I actually did it this time, guy. I fixed it. So while you're refueling, get over here and grab all that, and please unload your medals. Uh, over here. Uh. Why wasn't that working? Pick up. Drop off. <laughs> the ship's being stupid. <laughs> Make a route. Create route. Pick up. Yep. Okay. Come on. Somewhere. Anywhere. Uh. Anomaly analyzed. What's going on? <laughs> the explorer made a thorough scan of the anomaly site, but couldn't find anything unusual. Or, or were they? Just a sensor glitch, eh? So, I don't know why this, uh, this rover's being dumb, so I'm just gonna have him gather the sources. I will just do it manually, I guess. He's just, he's being a big dummy. He's just being a big dummy head. 
And uh, uh, I'd like everyone, uh, everyone's prayers for Doom. I think he's been in the bathroom for about half an hour now. So, uh, I, I really do hope everything is okay. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, scan that, five and six. And us, far away, seven, eight, nine. There we go, beautiful. Continue that scan. Let's bring this ship down with all of our machine parts. Bloop. Down it goes. So I think they're unloading all the uh, all the metals off now. Yep, they're unloading that there. Uh, scan the sector right uh, right on your dome. How did I not scan that before? You know, stop, stop, everyone, stop, everyone, stop scanning. Select a sector to scan. There, scan that. I, I never even saw that it wasn't scanned. That's fun. That's fun. Anomaly was successfully scanned. Yep, I know that. Beautiful. My perception is minus one in this game. What can I say? And we'll take you, turn you into metal. Wonderful. Grab all the fun parts. Fantastic. I'm Venom, host of Six more days to go. We just and you know what, Kakura was here earlier today, she deserves that somebody named after. Isadora! Let's name somebody Even though I like your show and your yeah, interesting girl. Talks, I sometimes find the way you express your opinions a little bit blunt. Everything Beautiful. can't be resolved through facts. We're all, all pioneers, uh, you, you know what, I have to name myself that. Like emotions, and I, and I'll be Colleen However, Jefferson, I do yeah. like the I'm gonna be, uh, and your Angel Lincoln. Magdalene. That's me. I understand. Sounds like my, uh, I find it hard my name. To come up with a I will think it over and get back to you with an Uh, answer. do you have dump sites near I'll your metal I extractor? Um, I don't, and I didn't know it needed one. So, uh, let's, that's not what I wanted. Let's, uh, take care of that then. Boop. That, that works now. <laughs> so I've been wondering why uh, my guys have been uh, working this way, just running over here <laughs> to that dump site, which is full too. So let's just uh, drop that there because you're gonna need that full dots. <laughs> Vela, that is me in bunny full. That is 100% me. <laughs> I am the derpiest rabbit in the in the rabbit den. <laughs> All right. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Art store is closed right now. That's fine. That's fine. Everyone's hard at work. Somebody pork. I need babies on my colony. 62 comforts. Do things. Have sex. Who's going to produce the first baby? It'll probably be Raven and Antagonizer. We will produce a lovely child. <laughs> the gasm. Uh, I need to keep dump sites close together. You can use them. Oh! You know what, guy? You're full of good ideas. <laughs> You're full of good ideas, my friend. <laughs> I did not know they actually had anything they could be uh, <laughs> um, used for. Spoiler alert. Um, concrete, I don't think I'm going to have too much of an issue with, to be honest with you. Um, I got one, two, I got third one, like, over here I can put down if I wanted to. Um, but then again, up here I don't have a lot of concrete. I'll probably do a better building when I put something up here. Uh, so I can grab the, uh... Ooh, there's water there. Where's those metals I found? Where sector were they? Scan. There they are. Anomaly found. Uh -huh. Select the sector to scan. I found an anomaly. Right next to my base, apparently. I did! It's like inside my base! Alright, uh, explore. Come on in. Bring it in. Uh, it's one of the last texts, but it cleans things up, which is uh, great for my OCD. I hear ya. I hear ya, guy. I hear ya. All resources are an issue. They are an issue. Uh, let's see. Let's get a sector to scan, then. I guess we'll just uh, start taking care of some of these closer ones, then. Fill out all that. Sounds like a good plan. Sounds like a plan to me. Beautiful. Beautiful. Everything's going on. Preach, brother. Preach! Hmm. And 
no anomaly. I know I found another anomaly. How far has it got to come in? He's going to be coming in from quite a distance, I believe. Yeah, he's... He doesn't get good traction. <laughs> he's not... I think he's a... Come on, buddy. I can walk faster than you. Come on. The camera scrolls. Uh, can I pull the graph up for food? You know what? Just for you, uh, guy, I will. Let's see. Where's my graphs? If I had a graph, where would I be? Milestones. Mission, that's mission profile. I don't need that. Uh, map overview. Good search. Power grid. Life support grid? No. Um, transportation. I have graphs. Aha! Cool. Food. There we go. Um, right now, I'm not really producing anything because I think I don't have enough uh, uh, botanists working actually in my hydroponics right now, which is a problem. Um, that's why I need more people in there. I want to bring some more botanists up because I want them working in the uh, the fungal, uh, the fungus farm, and the uh, hydroponics. I just want to fill those up with as much uh, botanists as I can. So kind of my next load of people bringing it, I'm going to bring in uh, probably about four or five more botanists, uh, or actually maybe six, so like six botanists, um, a few more geologists, and a couple scientists. I want to bring them in. I think that's kind of like a good mix up for the next shipment, and then I can immediately send for another one if I need to. So I don't know if you can see, yeah, you can see the graphics there. But, so uh, you good? Well, yeah, I mean, I'm consuming too. I still have a stockpile in because I actually brought some food up with me. Uh, so, I mean, we're not hurting for food, uh, which is a great thing. Always a great thing. We're not hurting. <laughs> Raven! <laughs> no problem, man. Raven, I named someone after you. I gotta find them. Where are you? Where are you, Raven? That's me. There you are. Where are you? You're... Uh, apparently invisible, or you are this pole, I think. But, um, let's see. Let's, can I get a picture of you? I don't, I don't want to kill you. Where are you? Alright, I gotta find you, Raven. Uh, but yeah, this right here is you. I don't know if you can see him. <laughs> that is you. You are Raven Vulcans. You have an awesome brush cut. I think you work over here at the art store. No, that's the other guy with the brush gun. Yeah, everyone loves living on Mars. You know, three-breasted women, lock of oxygen, alien device that give oxygen to the entire planet. Uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Uh, Guado. Uh, Val Kilmer. Still there. Uh, Mark Watney. Mars is all just... You know what? You can't go like 10 feet on Mars without bumping into another person. Matt Damon! <laughs> and Raven, uh, you also missed a very, very uh, awesome thing from Doom. Uh, Doom has donated $30 to the uh, uh, acquiring of a microphone, which uh, he also said he linked me in uh, Discord. So, again, a big thank you to uh, Doomster Fire for that donation. And I will be uh, actually purchasing that after the stream. Milestone <laughs> achieved. Milestone achieved. Fantastic. Produce 250 food, and the fireworks are off. In an oxygen depleted zone. But that's fine. That's fine. Wonderful. Oh, it's beautiful. It's even better when it's nighttime when this happens. Oh, they're so happy. The harvest has happened. And they're still celebrating. Alright. Uh, we're still waiting on the Martian born, though. So that means the leafy greens have been made. Um, I'd like to get a uh, different... Uh, let's see, we got that. Get some microgreens. Low yield, slow growth, one less water. You know what? Let's stay with them. Maybe some of them have babies. It's a celebration. It's a celebration. Maybe Raven and I will have babies, and uh, we'll have the first 
uh, first Martian-born child. I'm okay with this. Thing is, then I'm gonna cheat with Guy when he uh, arrives on Mars, but don't tell Raven, okay? Actually, we're on an alien place. planet. I'm gonna clone myself and have an affair with myself. How about that? <laughs> That sounds better with me. Dirty little secret. There's there's all kinds. Uh, the food in place has gone up. Uh, Vela with the gas. <laughs> I'm going to start my own Mars colony with blackjack and hookers. Actually, hold on one second. I got to check something real quick. For some reason, Streamlabs loves uh, playing with my alert volume. Uh, give me one second. Because I noticed when... Doom did his donation, the audio, maybe it's my headset, but the audio was not loud for some reason. So save the settings there. Okay. I think that fixed it. So. Okay. Close that. Alright, how are you on fuel? 22 of 50. We're going to get you set it on another exposition. Oh, it was loud on your side? Okay. Alright. Um, what's up here? Project Crossroads. You need a crew of seven. No. You need ro uh, robots. Uh, can I spin the planet? What do we got here? You need three scientists. Um. You know what? I got some drones, like, just hanging around, so... Let's get him going, and I'm going to just throw six drones that are up here. Um, I can, I can, <laughs> I can spare six drones. These guys are uh, kind of being lazy, lazy layabouts. Drone seven, you're lazy. Drone eighteen, drone seventeen, lazy drones. Uh, <laughs> it'll do it. Yeah, I'm not worried about that. They're just lazy drones. I was, just, I was shaming my drones guy. That's that's really what it came down to. <laughs> I, I was drone shaming. <laughs> uh, you want to start a new game in this? You absolutely should, Vela. You absolutely should. Uh, this game is that phenomenal. I'm learning so many things about it, and I love it. Thanks to you and uh, you and Guy, you're giving me some great information. And I can't remember if I put creamer in my coffee. I think this will be the last cup of the night too. So once this cup dries out, we're gonna be calling it for a night. I think we made some excellent progress too. I think we've done very, very well. Research complete. We're not quitting Anomaly just yet, though, analyzed. everyone. I didn't put any creamer in it. I took the creamer out, but I didn't do anything with it. You know, this is probably why I'm up at four o'clock in the morning some nights. <laughs> you have so many, yeah. That's my problem too, Vela. That's my, uh, that's why I'm only putting this at one day a week. Uh, that and Stellaris, because if I had them on multiple days, I wouldn't be able to play anything. Uh, that's also why I had to take uh, Lotro down to one day a week, because I wouldn't be able to play anything else. That's sadly what it came, what it was coming down to. Uh, let's see, research complete for drone swarm is done. Systemic training will give everyone better. Uh, thingamadoodles, RC transports. Ah, that's actually really good. Let's get that going too. That's a good one. What do you have? Uh, yeah, that's that was good too. Let's get that going. So that's why uh, there was that re that shuffle with the scheduling on the channel. Uh, RC Explorer. Was there anywhere to send you? I don't think there was. I found everything up there. We're waiting for all that to scan out. So we'll just leave the uh, him there. For now, my dome is so bright and beautiful. I love it. I love it. It's glorious. Glorious. All right. Uh, concrete is still nowhere near being a problem. Uh, 1905. And 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 Fuel is at 25 and 35. We are just at about there. I want to get that going before the end of the stream. I want to get that moving up on uh, for my next set of research. But I still really want to get uh, Agents of the Undergrowth, uh, Empires of the Undergrowth on the channel. 
because it's literally a game with ants in it. And I don't know why I am having so much problem, so many problems trying to get it to, uh, trying to get, like, the concept of it. And Monster Hunter, yeah. <laughs> uh, do you maybe want another fuel factory? Um, produces 12 per soul. I mean, I could. I could put another one down. Um, it wouldn't hurt. Uh, what do you use? Use five power and one water. Um, not right now, guy. I think I'm going to wait on that. Can I just make them whenever I want to? Let me just double check. Yeah, I can just make them whenever I want to. Uh, I'm going to wait right now. Oh, a machine part factory should have thrown you in there. Gosh darn it. Um, while my power grid is good, um, I'm not too worried about that. I am worried about um, my water production and oxygen production. Uh, so I kind of want to uh, maybe throw down another moxie with some more oxygen tanks in there. Because I'm going to have more people drawing in more oxygen uh, in five solar days. So, uh, and more water. I mean, maybe one more water... Uh, one more of the water extractor, and another moxie. Then I, I'm, I'm going to think of a fuel refinery at that point. Yeah, I think that's, I think, I think that's the way I'm going to go with that one. Uh, just for the uh, my sanity, I guess, would <laughs> be. I think that's a good idea. I mean, it's not feeling slow. I mean, it's close enough where the uh, drones don't have to make two... Uh... Yeah. Uh, do I... Can I make fan riders? I think I can since I'm a Hydro Engineer. I don't think that should be a problem. Yep. Yeah. Uh, no production during dust storms. Maintenance plus two. Yeah. That's that's not bad at all. And I have a prefab of it too. You know what? Let's lay it to... Actually, hold on. They don't like being near something, isn't it? They don't like being near... Was it the Vaporators? Or was it the... Um... Uh, there's something that doesn't like being next to another thing. I thought it was the Vaporators. Uh, let's see. Been tempted to buy Elite Dangerous. It looks like it could be fun. I've heard things about that. Uh, yes, I agree. That does look like it could be a lot of fun. I will, uh, I will wholeheartedly agree to that one. Uh, yeah, let's get the Vaporator in. I mean, I'm not going to worry about that. They need to be spread out. I think one over here. Uh, I think that's far enough away from the, uh... Oh, they don't like being next to each other. That's what they don't like being next to. Gotcha. Yep. So let's get the vaporator in. That's fine. That'll that'll ease my problems with the uh, with the water production. Then I'm not gonna be too worried about that. We're already at 28 to 35. I'll get that up and running now uh, before we call it quits. Um, I've been looking at a couple other games. I want to get Victorum. That looks like a fun game too, and it's on sale. And because I'm way behind the times, uh, Sunless Sea. I think is what it's called. Uh, that looks like a fun game, and it's all about me dying, so that'll be fun to stream. I think that's its name. Not 100% sure. It's like $4.99 right now on, uh, on Steam, so... Not too worried about that. Vaporator is up and running out three that good, but you need some pipes. Yep, I know, I just saw it. <laughs> there we go. Just saw it. Uh, yes! Uh, well, I mean, I have it. I haven't put too much time in it, because, I mean, none of my friends have it. <laughs> none of my friends have it, so I really haven't been able to put, like, a really good, uh, like, multiplayer time into it yet. Um, I need to get Raven in the game, and throw Puma in the wrath with me, and, uh, we'll see who comes out alive <laughs> at the end of the day. Um, you know, it'll be a fun thing. But yeah, I have it. I mean, I played on creative mode, because I like building things, and I made a huge, cool wrath. I don't like sharks. <laughs> so, as you can tell, when I play Subnautica, I don't like being under the ocean. I am not James Cameron. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, but, but yeah, I do, I do own it. I just gotta, uh, get it, get some, uh, get, like, a team together. Pretty much is what I gotta do. Alright. Hey, when did I, when did I drop frames? 0.4% dropped frames? That's no good. That's no good at all. Oh, well, it happens. Somnotica is hard. It is. It is. I like it. I really do. I'm not going to say I... I'm not going to say I wasn't uh, actually afraid when I was playing it, because you know, I was. 
And if you watch the VOD, you can tell that I was genuine. <laughs> I did not like the, uh, that creature that I saw by the ship. Did not like it one bit. Nope. Didn't like it when I was swimming in pitch black sea, trying to make it back to my, uh, my pod. Didn't like it when he yelled at me as I was running away. Didn't like any of that. <laughs> Oh, uh, let's see here. Uh, to have fun in a raft solo, you gotta play on easy so you're not just chasing food uh, and water all the time. Well, Raven, we should play some raft, man. Raft man. 31 to 35. We're almost ready for fuel to get that out there. Uh, we're still on five solar days, so I think probably next time we play, next weekend, we'll be able to get our next set of colonists in. And I don't want to do that until... Um, do I have a second ship? Uh, I don't have a second ship here. I don't want to do that until I get, um, or I don't want to build the fungal farm until I get that second ship and people on their way. Um, I don't want to waste the materials right now when they can just be put with something else. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. But then it makes everything else too easy, yeah. Yeah, that's, I mean, it's a delicate balance of, uh, that you're gonna have to, be, you're gonna have to deal with on that. I, I completely understand. That is such a cool thing. Drone number two? What are you doing? You're doing nothing. You're just being lazy, drone number two. Why don't you come over here? There we go. Beautiful. Uh, <laughs> Raven, I read that completely wrong, and I thought it said that you like fisting for materials. And you know what? <laughs> More power to you if that's what you said, but you didn't. You didn't say that, everyone. <laughs> uh, let's see. When life gives you lemons... Alien world. That takes guts, to say the least. Uh-oh. Raven! Here we go. Building a new home on an alien world, that takes guts, to say the least. After all, the purpose is the strongest long-term driver. Since arriving on Mars, Raven Vulcan's enthusiasm has proven to be above average, even by founder norms, and the precipitous productivity display can be boiled down to one simple explanation. Raven Vulcans really loves doing what Raven Vulcans doing. Hint, the founder Raven Vulcans has the enthusiast trait. Oh, uh, that's the spirit, Raven. That's the spirit. That's the spirit, Halloween. And Vale is showing us where the rainbows come from. <laughs> you are famous. You are Mars famous. And that's like 20 fathoms more famous than Earth famous. Uh, you are like space like Kanye West is that it is he still famous I don't know I don't have cable anymore so I'm kind of like on about things uh, you're 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 famous like uh young Sheldon you're no you're famous official like uh, another letter from one of our listeners uh, hey there, Penham. what's up me you are so yes, cool you're Almost famous as like cool me. as the music you play <laughs> just kidding would you like to meet up? Sometime? Oh, right. We're at four solar days. Fantastic. New days begun. Uh, we're at 33 or 35. Two more fuel, and we can send off the Base Palm 1. I'm going to rename it Base Palm 1. You know how to reach base Palm 1. Actually, can I put that in? Hold on. Because we're going to make it just as Guy wanted, Steve. Hashtag Face Palm. It actually worked. Excellent. That is... It's going to crash into the planet. It's going to send it on an expedition. And it's just going to go... <laughs> because that's what it do <laughs> probably <laughs> all my drones will take their little robotic hands and just go <laughs> oh my oh moisty have moisty alright so yeah we're gonna launch this thing uh, let it find whatever it finds and then uh, yeah we're gonna call it at that point I think so we're just waiting for you to fuel up one more fuel and that will shoot up and out. That's the face bomb, Vela. That's the face bomb. Alright, so you're not yeah, I need I really need to fill out uh, at least I want two more shifts. Uh, at least one more shift, I should say. For my rare metal extractor to build that up. Um, you know what it might not be a bad idea? Getting a storage depot for rare metals. And just kind of like dropping it over here. So they don't have to transport as far. So keep it nice and close. And is that free to make? Yeah, that's cool. Cool beans. 
And you are, come on, just fill with fuel. Bring that fuel, little drone. Well, I have, uni I have universal ones over here, so they're dragging it all the way uh, from over there to over here. So having one nice and close is actually going to be much more, uh, I think, much more efficient. And less stupid. Less stupid. Alright, load it up with drones and off he goes. I can't even Research click on it. Complete. Come on. Fire that rock. There we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, basically, we're supposed to be going next to every extractor, yeah. Let's reset the camera. And we finished up with, uh, what did we finish? Ah, systemic training. So, botanists have a 10% performance when working in their specialty. Fantastic, so that means my botanists working at the hydroponic farms. Morale and correct workplace specialization. Beautiful. And that means you should also have... You're still hungover. Radoslav Dmitriov, you have been drunk for four days on Mars. Since you, were, since you arrived on Mars, you have been drunk. <laughs> You know what? Sector Fine. Scan. Anomaly found. Ooh, found an anomaly. Beautiful. Uh, let's get the explorer to work. Wonderful. Turn the camera around so we got him off and exploring. Wonderful. Monster we are doing all. Achieved. Somebody had sex. Somebody had sex. Thing is getting spicy over here on Mars. The first baby has been born. Oh. <laughs> For the first time, a human has been born on Mars. It's truly a unique miracle. <laughs> now eat it. <laughs> now I can bring people in. Something Satan. <laughs> oh my God! I I saw those shirts over at uh, Spencer's Gifts. Uh, like, they look like the old school, uh, like, Timmy plays baseball or something like that. But it's like, what, summon Satan? <laughs> uh, the door toward the stars. The colonists have always felt like a family, but what makes a family stronger and more united is the promise of new life and better future. We have truly been blessed with a rewarding responsibility to care the, carry the torch of hope. Let this blooming of life serve as a symbol for all humans. Mars is no longer a dead world. The effect the colony has been evaluated positively. Additional columns may can be called. Beautiful. I'm going to pause it real quick because I want to uh, buy free supply pods. Excellent. Excellent. And we have unlocked the new milestone. And I need to see who, who for, who did it. Who, who babied it up. Are you the baby? You're the baby. Vector, you're the child. Who is your parents? Tell me who your parents are. Does it say who the parents are? Uh, your child, I know. Who are your parents? He doesn't have a le uh, Picard, Vector Picard. So Jean Luc. It wasn't Raven. It wasn't Doomster. Bruce Yen, antagonizer, Colleen Jefferson. I have no idea who gave birth to this child. I could evict the child. Um, I don't like that I can't tell who did it. Call the kid Matt Damon. Um, you got it. Matt Damon. Done and done. Buy free supply pods. That is... Yep, that was one of my goals. Mission goals. Give me five supply... Uh, five supply plobs. Because I know English good. Alright, so... That... Yes. Yes. My life's work is complete. And that's when, that's when fucking guy just vanished into the ether. And never to be seen again. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Guy just went. My work here is done, ma'am. <laughs> oh, 
Now I need a potato farm and to put them in work there. That is 100% true. I can actually, well, I can put them, <laughs> I can put them into, uh, I can put them into a mushroom farm. Does that count? Is that close enough? All right. Ah, oh, the fireworks. Well-deserved fireworks. So, uh, I think uh, we're going to say it was Raven and my uh, child. Uh, we'll, we will raise it as one of our own. Uh, I'm going to try and keep Raven from eating the child, uh, because he's want to do so. He's gone cannibal now that he's living on Mars, which is a sad state. He's gone insane. But then again, he ate children on Earth, and that's why we sent him to Mars. Hmm. Ah, uh, that would have been Raven. Raven delivered. Let me summon Hell on Mars. They already did that with, uh... Uh, God, what was that? Oh, I can't even remember the name of that movie. I didn't like it, though. It was Ghosts of Mars. That one. That They summon Hell on Mars. Listen, Doom. Don't make fun of Doom. That had The Rock in it. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And Carl Ur uh, Carl Urban? Keith Urban? I don't know. Some Urban. It was totally consensual. <laughs> uh, they never summon hell, only in the game. Well, in Doom, you're right. They injected uh, Carl Urban with uh, with a drug and turned him into a first-person shooter at the end. And then the rock became a demon. So, you know, happens. <laughs> so I think with that, before we bring in our next batch of settlers uh, to colonize the moon and we'll make our fungus farm next time, ladies and gentlemen, I think... We are good for now. Let's drop the save. Good timing because, you know what? This will be time everyone can step out, grab a uh, candy cigarette, and just... Because you're this on Mars and you don't want it to uh, colonize the moon. I know I missed a thing. Stay tuned. Enjoy. <laughs> we, we've moved to the moon. <laughs> Those colonists are going to be really, really weird and really upset when they arrive on the moon. And they'll be like, um... Oh, uh, my words are tripping over themselves now. It's been a long day. Let's save the game. New save game. Stream to 2019. Fantastic. The moon, the Mars. You know what? You know what, guy? They all have the same uh, letters to begin with, right? Right, right, right. That's exactly what I meant. I meant to catch you in it, and you're you're the most perceptive on the channel, and uh, you're. You win a prize. You win, um... You win... Hold on. You do win something. Hold on. You win something. Uh... I don't have anything. Crap. I don't have anything you can win. I didn't mean to lie. <laughs> yes! You get to be a scientist! A scientist! You get to, that's what you get to be. That's what you get to win. You're a scientist. Oh, so, uh, before I do switch it off here to see if, uh, someone out there is playing some kick-ass games tonight, I want to say thank you, Vela, thank you, Doom, Doomster Fire, thank you for everyone for being so generous today, I really do appreciate it. Uh, we will be back with Surviving Mars on next Saturday, where we will bring in that fucking guy onto our planet, and he will revolutionize science as humanity has known it. <laughs> and I am gonna buy my mic after I finish the stream. Raven, quit interrupting me. But yes, uh, I do want to say, again, Vela, thank you very much. You're always so generous. That's why you are the VIP. I really do appreciate it. And Doom, thank you again for everything. Again, greatly appreciate it. We are going to send it on over to... Let me see who's live. Who is live? Thank you very much, Raven. Much appreciated. Who's live? We got Mike. Why is it saying Puma's still chatting? Puma's not online. Is Puma still streaming? Okay, never mind. Now it's not showing. Uh, looks like Mike is playing Ken Follett's Pillars of the Earth. Uh, yeah, let's send it over to Mike. Uh, we've been having good luck on his side uh, lately, so... Mike, another good friend of the colony. Thank you, everyone. Again, Vela, thank you. That fucking guy, thank you again for all the help today. Hope to see you tomorrow for Stellaris. We will return to space, but hopefully we'll find some neighbors this time. Hmm. <laughs> All right, Raven, take it easy. Everyone out there lurking, everyone out there just listening, everyone out there just in general, have an awesome night.
Peace out. Okay, that's good. Um, 